Welcome everybody, I'm Derek Smith and this is Pop-Up Camper Pro. Do you have an air conditioner shroud on your camper that looks like this? Today you're gonna to learn how to choose the right one and how to replace it. Step one, ID the AC. Take a look at the air conditioner on your camper. They're not all the same, and not every shroud is going to work with every unit. There is a common BTU, and that's 13.5. When it comes to manufacturers, Coleman and Dometic have been the top two for many, many years. After 2010, we began to see new manufacturers hit the market, such as Furion and Atwood, and even GE today. You see, many manufacturers have not kept records of the ACs that were installed on their units. Coleman and Fleetwood pop-up campers, they never came with an air conditioner. It was always installed at the dealership or by the customer after the sale. Now for Coleman pop-ups, there is a most popular model, and that is the Coleman Mach Series. Please note, it was just the most common. You'll see that the Coleman we're working on today has a Dometic unit installed. To help ID your air conditioner, take a good look at the shape and some measurements. For finding the manufacturer model numbers, these are typically on or under the shroud or on the unit itself. To replace our shroud, I chose a Dometic brisk air kit. Remove all the mounting screws that you find. This Dometic unit has them located around the bottom. Other manufacturers such as Coleman have them on the top. Now lifting from the back, remove the old shroud. For this unit, we will have to remove the original mounting band and reuse it on our new shroud. Drill the rivets that are attaching the mounting band to the old shroud. Place the old band on the new shroud. With 3 16 expansion rivets, install it. Expansion rivets grip from the back like hollow wall anchors. Some units require some modifications for replacement shrouds. This one needs foam seals installed and the rear brackets trimmed at this angle. Clean the area and dry it completely. I'm using a glass cleaner for this job. Remove the backing from the tape and install it on the ends and across the top for this unit. Now place the new shroud back on the unit starting from the front and lower it to the rear. Work around the unit until the mounting points are all aligned correctly. Install all of your mounting screws. And that's it. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe to the channel and ring that notification bell so you never miss another how-to, uh, episode, coupon code, I appreciate you guys. I'll see you at the campground.